looking like this severe thunderstorm. It was in effect till 645, just got extended till 730. This includes Monongalia County and Preston County, and this one is moving eastward at about 30, 35 miles per hour, has large hail and the potential for damaging winds. Right now, the biggest hail, this black showing up here, that's the, the biggest reflectivity we have going through Georgetown, heading towards Little Falls, just north of Pleasant View here, and this is going to pass the worst of it just south of Morgantown, although Morgantown will see some heavy rain, thunder, lightning, and wind out of the deal. Now, the hail in this could be as big as a quarter or a 50 cent piece. So large hail there, another severe thunderstorm approaching Wheeling right now from Ohio. That's going to continue to stay down to the south, so we'll watch that one as it gets closer. And several other thunderstorms on the board that we're watching right now south of Pittsburgh. Things have been starting to lighten up a little bit, just some leftover light rain from Wilkinsburg to Munhall back into West Mifflin. This is past Wilmerding and moving past Monroeville for the time being, and you can see Monongahela seeing some of these heavier showers getting down towards Charleroi as well. So we have some spots with the heavier rain moving through for the time being, and as we continue through the rest of this evening, we're going to see that being the case. But you can see those darker clouds in the distance. Those are those bigger storms uh, down to the south of us as uh, we look right now basically to the uh, east off the action cam. 64 degrees right now. South southwesterly winds 9 miles per hour, but again near those thunderstorms, those are picking up and temperatures are all over the place. We have the 60s and 70s going on right now. 70 Butler, 71 Catanning, 64 in Pittsburgh, but we just had some heavy rain pass through. 70 down in Morgantown, but once that storm comes in, you're going to see some of that rain cooled air moving into the picture as well. Now, temperatures through the night are going to drop down into the upper 50s and then tomorrow we're going to bounce to the mid to upper 60s for high, so a little bit cooler for high temperatures tomorrow, but you'll see these scattered showers and thunderstorms, the worst of it down south, southern Ohio, southern West Virginia, seeing that second wave of rain is what we're watching here. This is going to be around for the morning commute tomorrow, but I think a lot of this is going to head up towards I-80 as this passes by. So this whole system is going to continue working through the area tonight into tomorrow, and that's going to leave us with these scattered showers and thunderstorms. So scattered showers tonight. We catch a little break early tonight, and then tomorrow morning, the next round of showers comes through, the worst of it up to the north, but scattered showers through about lunchtime. And then we start to see that clear from west to east, some peaks of sunshine later in the day, partly cloudy for most of Tuesday. Tuesday evening, some showers hook back up here. We're going to see some of those showers lasting into Wednesday too. So for the big screen tomorrow, 62 degrees as we go into game three, partly cloudy and comfortable. So tonight at midnight, 61 scattered showers, an isolated thunderstorm for Pittsburgh. Better chances for those thunderstorms down to the south, 56 tomorrow morning when you get up, mostly cloudy, some scattered showers, and then tomorrow afternoon we start to clear it out a little bit, 68 degrees for our high temperature. Over the next four days, temperatures here are going to stay in the low to mid 60s, and then we drop into the upper 50s for Thursday. Your four day plus four more shows those cool temperatures lasted to Friday. A little bump up in the temperature department next weekend.